review of The Hills of California, Sam Men steers Jez Butterworth's erratic family drama and the direction of fumbling boredom. Comparison is said to be the thief of happiness. It is regrettable to say that I haven't seen Jez Butterworth's critically acclaimed hit play Jerusalem, directed by Mark Rylance, which many critics have already mentioned in their reviews of The Hills of California. However, it was a welcome change to evaluate this play purely on its own merits, without bias or preconceptions. The main issue with these three hours of bumbling dullness is that there isn't much to be happy about. Sam Menz helms it irregularly, and Butterworth occasionally underwrites it. The writing is also inconsistent. The narrative centers on the Webb sisters, a quartet of former child stars who are now gathering at the Blackpool family hotel because their mother is dying upstairs. However, Joan, the most disobedient and obviously the closest to their strict manager, mother, is still in California. There are only so many elements that Butterworth feels the need to elaborate on in the first act, and it seems from the way he directs that Menz is aware of this.